Behind me is a diagram describing the differences between myofibrillar and sarcoplasmic hypertrophy. And because everyone still is telling me that muscle is built through micro tears, uh, I'm just going to educate a little bit um, about the differences between sarcoplasmic and myofibrillar hypertrophy. So muscle is made out of muscle fibers and fluid, right? There's a good amount of fluid, so H2O and glycogen inside the muscle fiber. And there is a good amount of muscle fibers inside that make up the muscle, right? So myofibrillar hypertrophy is the addition of new contractile tissues or new myofibrils inside the muscle, right? The intended muscles getting new muscle fibers. This is achieved through the involuntary slowing of the contractile phase and it occurs during the last five intense reps of a set, right? So that involuntary slowing of the contraction is what signals against the actin and myosin protein to then stimulate more growth, right? Or primarily pulling on that protein titan, right? So that's how you grow more tissue. Sarcoplasmic hypertrophy, on the other hand, is the expansion of sarcoplasm or the fluid inside the space in between the fibers. So if you see here, the space in between the fibers, and as you get more sarcoplasmic hypertrophy, the fluid increases, more blood flow, more glycogen stores increase, it swells up and creates a really nice pump, making the muscle appear larger. Now again, this is achieved through lighter weights and less intensity, and it's often associated with increase in water and glycogen. However, sarcoplasmic hypertrophy is not Permanent. It only lasts for maybe 30 to 35 minutes during or after an intense workout. Whereas new myofibrillar hypertrophy, so new growth of the myofibrillars, is growth of the new muscle tissue, right? So you're actually growing long lasting, stronger muscle as opposed to just getting a pump. And basically, that's the difference between sarcoplasmic versus myofibrillar hypertrophy. Hopefully, this helps you guys. And um, if I get any comments saying that micro tears is what stimulates myofibrillar hypertrophy, I'm gonna. I'm going to lose it. So please don't.